Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Garry Kasparov and Ian Nepomniachtchi. This is a game from St. Louis Rapid Chess Tournament played in 2017. Garry Kasparov had white pieces and he started with d4. Ian Nepomniachtchi played knight to f6. c4, g6, knight to c3, and now d5, the Grunfeld defense. Knight to f3, bishop to g7, white to move. White can continue in many different ways. The most played moves in this position are bishop to g5, c takes on d5, queen to b3, e3, and bishop to f4. Gary Kasparov played a super sharp h4. Black to move. C6 was played. If cancelling, then h5. After knight takes on h5, white can capture the pawn on d5 with the pawn or with the knight. Back to our game. The Pomniacci played c6, delaying castling. Bishop to g5. D takes on c4. e4. Bishop to e6, defending the pawn e5, attacking the knight, knight to d5, white to move. Should white take on c4 with the bishop or not? Kasparov played h5. If bishop takes on c4, knight takes on c3 and black is winning. h5, knight to d7, h6, bishop to f8. And black has a cramped position. Knight to e4, f6. Attacking the bishop, bishop to d2, b5, defending the pawn, a4, bishop to f5, perhaps a6 comes to mind, but Nepomniachtchi had a different plan, you will see what the plan is. Bishop to f5, knight to g3, attacking the bishop, e6, knight takes on f5, how to recapture, with e pawn or with g pawn? What would you do? General rule says to capture towards the center. The Pomniachi played e takes on f5. That's the correct way to capture in this case. If g takes on f5, a takes on b5, c takes on b5, and now knight to g5, intending queen to h5, very unpleasant for black. So we have e takes on f5. A takes on b5, c takes on b5, bishop to e2, bishop to e7, and Kasparov castle at kingside. Perhaps a6 comes to mind, defending the pawn on b5, but then white can play bishop to a5. To prevent bishop to a5, the Pomniachi played a5, white to move, b3, the standard move undermining black's pawn structure. c3, bishop takes on b5, c takes on d2, e6 attacking the pinned knight, castling and unpinning, e takes on d7, knight to c3 forking the queen and the bishop, but Kasparov solved the problem by bishop to c4 check. King to h8, queen takes pawn on d2, knight to e4 attacking the queen, Queen to e3. Now white is a pawn up. Queen takes on d7, equal. Knight to d2. Knight takes on d2. Queen takes on d2. Black to move. The Pomniachi played a very important move. Bishop to b4. This is not only attacking queen. This is preventing white from playing rook to e1. Queen to d3. Queen to d6. Rook to a2, intending rook to e2, fighting for the open file. Rook from a to e8, rook to e2, queen to f4, g3, queen takes on h6, and black king is much happier now when the pawn on h6 is gone. And now black is a pawn up, king to g2, f4, very nice move, exchanging the double pawn for a healthy white pawn. Rook to h1, 
queen to g5, rook takes rook, rook takes rook, and black is in the control of the very important open e-file. Kasparov was not happy with his position. He was shaking his head. Bishop to f7, attacking the rook. What is the best square for the rook? What would you do in this position if you had black pieces? Please pause and find the best move for black. Did you pause? What did you find? Ian Nepomniachi rose to the occasion and went for glory with a killer move. Rook to e3. What a move. What a move. White move. If white does not take the queen, let's say white plays queen to d1, then f3 check, and after king to g1, rook to e1, and black is winning. So, Kasparov captured the rook, queen takes on g3 check, king to f1, black played a move and white resigned. The move is, what would you do? Nepomniachi played f3 and Kasparov resigned. The threat is queen to g2, checkmate. And there is another threat. If queen to c2, defending against queen to g2, checkmate. Then queen to e1, checkmate. Well done, Ian Nepomniachi. What do you think of this game? Would you like to improve your attacking skills? If you would, please click on the link below the video and download Play Like Tal DVD, Killer Endgames and much, much more.